Okay, so here's our nursery for twins that I finally have finished. <laughs> Crips from Facebook Marketplace, but I did buy the mattresses separately, which are Newton mattresses and the muslin sheets, which are just the best from Amazon. I have a few spares of those, but let's start with the dresser, okay? So I did a makeover of this dresser. As soon as you open it, it's going to be their current size that they're going to be wearing at the moment which is going to be right now the newborn size i have all the sleepers over here onesies long sleeve or sleepers pants and shirts we're going to the next drawer this is the next size up which is zero to three months and once we'll just be switching it's a gradual process so i wanted to dedicate this drawer to the next size up no matter which size they're wearing currently this is going to be next size up because going up in size happens gradually, not like in one day. So this one's next size up. They're not going to be ready for it yet, but as they are, we're just going to be pulling stuff out of here and put it in here, I guess. So this is the sleep, the same categories, onesies, long sleeve, pants and shirts. And I'm waiting for more separators to come from Timu. They just have not been delivered yet. Separators just like this. They're like 250 or something for two, I can't remember, but it's a very, very good price. The next drawer down, light blankets, changing table sheets, crib sheets, muslin swaddles, and burps. And the next, the last one, is going to be extra burps, bibs, hats, bath towels three towels and some bath cloths and socks these socks are current size anything that's bigger in size is going to be in the closet so we're gonna start in the closet I just did a makeover had to take everything out of here and fill it up with just baby, th baby, baby stuff. Next size up after they turn three months. First of all, this is what they're gonna be wearing right now, current size, but extras I'm not sure about, if I'm gonna need it, didn't fit, whatever, just extras. Next is three months and three months. All the clothes for their next size up, all of the clothes. Next, if we turn this way, Next size up should be technically six months. So this one is from kind of six to 12, nine months. This one is 12 months. You would go this way and you would go to 18 months, 24 months, 18 months. These are some extras for 18 months that did not fit into the other box. And this is sleepwear of all sizes. I could not really fit them anywhere else. So the smaller sizes on the, on the top, sleep gowns large on the bottom. So the smaller sizes on the top, and as you take them out, as they grow out of it, we're gonna get to the bottom, to the biggest size, which is like 2T. If they get any hand-me-downs right now, I don't wanna be digging through those boxes, separating the new clothes by size. I'm just gonna throw them into this basket or I'll find a bigger basket. This is new hand-me-downs. So far, I already have a few, so I'm gonna need to find myself a better solution for this. A bigger basket or something. These are warm blankets. I have four. This is just random toy. This is oversized diapers, which I made a mistake, so they're gonna get to them eventually. This is some Halloween stuff that got uh, donated to us so don't know um regular 
crib sheets which they have not grown into yet but they will be using them eventually just a toy didn't know where else to put it i don't know what to call these but for you know for their diaper change rash lotion or baby oil and these are baby proofing just everything to keep to keep house safe Clorox wipes to wipe everything. This is refills for diaper genie hangers. And this organizer is really quite empty. I think I'm gonna stack it with shoes because I still have some more shoes downstairs that were given to us and I forgot about them. These are swimming diapers. So that's it. This is the closet. Any kind of new diapers that did not, that will not fit, uh, that will not fit on the changing table, we will be storing over here. Diaper wipes and diapers. I mean, baby wipes and diapers. Changing table. Speaking of, this is the changing table. I will still be needing to change the sheet, just because I haven't had the babies yet. But the cat loves sleeping on these. I know it's not a good option, but anyways, this is for her for right now. I'm planning to change the sheet and not let her sleep on that anymore. And these are baby wipes, newborn size, size one diapers, some whatever, self-explanatory. This is my dresser, which I decided not to empty all the way and repurpose. It's just, I keep my things in here. This is my personal. This one is, I just labeled it to sort of mommy stuff where I will keep for now. For now, I am keeping my breast pumps in here, two of the breast pumps and the baby carrier. This one is to do with organization of the house, just because I don't have another space for it. This is like, for example, cord organization, all sort of hooks, labels. It's just my stuff. And I know that it will be here a little bit more organization such as drawer organization and these zip bags which I get from Timo at a very decent price these are my old labels for the kitchen and this is just our personal I don't know just kind of scrap paper whatever got this little organizer from Walmart and I have labeled it and if I put something else in here I can always label it, label it a little bit more uh, I like keeping this if I need to open boxes somewhere for diaper boxes and for wipes it's just always annoying to try and rip that tape so scissors these are passes and nail cutters uh, baby gel some ointments and I guess this okay we have a picture frame over there I'm gonna change it to little man M-E-N <laughs> some baby stuff I'm planning to connect these to the pacifiers I will be doing that I will also have some lotion and baby wash this is a diaper bag which I will be taking out of here as soon as I organize it a little bit better just to carry around the house like a changing bag that's for their toys in the future but for right now they don't have many toys at all uh, these are their security blankets two of each I don't know which one they're gonna like better and there's another one dinosaur and another the same kind all right so this is it the curtains I got from Walmart and they are wonderful they completely block all of the light and they are very good quality and a very decent price they were about $30 to see don't see anything through them and they were about $30 for the bigger size and set of two. So yeah, this is the little project that I did. Got the this chair from 
Facebook, uh, Facebook Marketplace and just put a blanket over it because the fabric is not the best looking. That one we had already. Got this toy for $25 at um, Once Upon a Child. Great store. The little mobiles we got from Amazon. Very affordable, something like $20. And I'll leave the links for everything in the description. This is the diaper genie and the trash bag. Diaper genie, I prefer this one. This one came from, I think, Sam's Club, around $50. I got another one for $30, which I do not like and I will not recommend. This one is the one I would recommend because you just press with your foot on this and do this. For baths, I still need to find space for these. These are the baths we will be using. Amazon. This is for the sink. These are the monitors, which my husband still have not installed, but he will. And this is a little shelf from Timo, which I'm planning to hang somewhere on the wall. It's like five dollars from Timo. Okay. So yes, that was the that was the nursery for the twin babies. They're both boys and they're arriving anytime soon in just a couple of days. And I'm actually scheduled to have them in four days unless they arrive by themselves. I am 37 weeks right now. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know what you think. Any suggestions are welcome. Thanks. Bye-bye.